Hi, today my topic is how you can design your presentation slide very beautifully. Like here, as you can see, I have designed my presentation slides using objects, shapes, and I have given a background color. So please subscribe my channel and press the bell icon so you can see my videos as early as possible. So let's get started. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take a blank presentation, blank page. So firstly, I want to give it a baby pink color as I have given here. So I will give it a color. Uh, what will you do? You will right click your mouse on this slide and you will go to background. So if you go to the, if you click on background, on the right side, you will see a new window will be open that is object formatting from here you can give it a baby pink or any color as you like but I am gonna give for example this color I like it so I'm gonna give this color after giving this color now I want to add the shapes I want to give it a good design so what I'll do in the insert section here you can see shapes if I click on shapes there are a lot of shapes you can see here lot of shapes so I am going to select this pie shape if I select this you can see a plus so now what I'll do I'm gonna drag it like that oh what I'm gonna do let me delete it what I'm gonna do I'll go on shapes and this and I'm gonna drag it like that so I want this much size so I will drag it and I'll keep it firstly here I'll start from here so I'll keep it to the edges yeah so as you can see I'll rotate it a little from here you can rotate you can see this rotate sign from here if you click you can rotate it I'll rotate it a little bit so yeah I have rotated it like that so now I'm gonna change its color how will I change its color I'll click on it and from here you can see here it's there are a lot of colors there are a lot of effects you can see or you can fill simple colors and it I'm gonna select this color like no I'm gonna select from an effect like I, I will select this effect I like this one one bit more I don't like I'm gonna change it like I'm gonna get this yeah so I'm gonna give this effect or you can give a uh, effect from this menu also as you can see here from inside the drawing tools inside the drawing tools you can also see many effects from here also you can change the effect so what I'm gonna do I will copy this by clicking on it and I will press ctrl C if I click on ctrl C it will be copied and I'm gonna paste it by pressing ctrl V so this is being copy it and I'm going, going to uh, move it here and I'm going to rotate it from here like as you can see yeah so I will move it and I will move it to the end where it's it joins yeah like how here it needs to move like I'm taking it here like I can little move it here little little it's gonna so as you can see I can rotate it more if I want so I'm gonna rotate it a little more not more but a little more it's not gonna set like that so yeah after that I want to do I want it to be a little at this side so I'm gonna rotate it I don't know why it's opening so let's rotate it like here or maybe I'm gonna rotate it here okay so I will copy that again. I will again press Ctrl V. One more shape will be copied. And I am going to keep it here. By rotating it this side. And I am going to keep it to the end. As you can see I will keep it to the end. And here you can see I can keep it in the end. So this will be copied here. So I will copy one more. Then Ctrl V and I am going to paste it here also. I will rotate it again and as you see yes you will keep it to the edge yes so as you can see here four same shapes but different sides I have added here so I'm going to add one more shape inside it from the sh shape section that, that you can see inside the insert one so inside the insert of a girl of shapes from here I'm gonna select 
this shape or this one yeah I'm gonna select curved down arrow if I select this I'm gonna drag it like that yeah so what I'm gonna do I'm gonna rotate it like that and I'm gonna move it inside here so I will move it to the end of this yeah as you can see here also I have done I can make it a little short if I want but that's my choice so what I'm gonna do I'm going to change its color I will I can change its color from here as you can see there are four options I will go to the shape fill and I'm going to select the red color because I like like it very much so if I want I can make it a little small but it's by my wish so what I'm gonna do I'll again do the same step that I have done before I will do control C and then I'm gonna copy it control V and you can see a new same shape is being copied and I will rotate here according to this shape and I'm gonna paste it here as you can see yeah to the end I will copy it again by pressing control V and if I press Ctrl V, one more shape will be there. So I'm gonna rotate it again. I'm gonna paste it here to the end. Oh my god. Okay. But it's not in the end. I'll a little bit take it to the end. Maybe move it to the end. Yes. I'll again press Ctrl V and copy this one here. And I'm gonna rotate it again. The same steps are being done again and again maybe I have to move it to the end so I'm going to take it again and move here yes now it's good now as you can see I have made it like that a little bit now a little more is left now I want to add this shape how I will add this from the again if you go to insert you will see here the shapes option from here I will select you can select any shape you like to add let me change a bit I'll add this heart shape so what I'm gonna do I will copy ish yes so I'm gonna rotate it again so paste it here I will do a little change as you see because I like to make changes so as you can see this is being changed what I'm gonna do I'll change its color like I like color of gray or maybe something else little more gray yeah it's look nice same I will copy it again and again again and again I'll paste it three more times one two three so yeah three more times so I'll just copy it rotate it one by one so yeah it's look very good and I'm gonna just take this and just copy it one by one so that my presentation will look very good you can design as you want but you know you should know how you have to do it so nothing is difficult but you need a practice and you can make it very beautiful so as you can see here uh, I have done but only the this part is left so what I'm gonna do in here again I'm using shapes and shapes but in the next next part I will use different ways to design or make your presentation slide more beautiful but let's complete with the shapes so here I will select this one as you can see half frame you can select frame if you want if you want that you want to keep a frame here like that as you can see that's your choice it's your choice as you like but I want half frame so I will select this half frame and I will paste here like that as you can see wow it's very nice now what I want I just I am tired of adding colors and colors so now I would like to add gradient you know what is gradient gradient is a mixture of colors gradient is a mixture of colors so from here if I go to 
I will click on I'll click right click and I will from here I'll if I go wrong I can So what I'm going to do if I click on here I will select from uh, even I can select colors but I want to add gradients so let me see from where we can add gradients I just background as you can from here you can see there is gradient fill you will click on background and from here again that window will be open from here you can select gradient fill as I click on gradient fill it changes why because I have not selected that object so I'm going to click on control Z. if I select this object and then I go to the this one uh, let me click here I'll click here right background if there is an option of background here I know why it's not coming but yeah from here I can add many as a more yeah so from here you can see gradient so uh, I will select here gradient fill as you can see it has changed I want to select a good gradient like from here you can see texture fill pattern fill uh, let me add pattern if I add this pattern it's not look good let me select a good good pattern like this one no not this one also yeah this one also looks good if you see this but this one is also a good one i like this one i like this one and what i'm gonna do is i'll in insert one more shape that is the this one no what i'll do i'll just okay i'll just copy this one Control c and Control v if i copy it i'll get a one more and i'm gonna just rotate it yeah so as you can see i rotated it and now as you can see it gives me a new look it's very beautiful you can give as many changes you can add as many so here i'm gonna add a text like 